Hi guys and welcome to another video. Today I will be reviewing a razor blade. Uh, this is a very, very popular double edged razor blade. And this is Wilkinson Sword. Now, Wilkinson Sword used to be made uh, using Sheffield steel in England. But now these are classed as German blades and so these are made in Germany. So as always, I've had my ball brush shirt soaking in hot water. I'm using my Victor razor, which is very mild for something that's kind of new. I've got that in there soaking. And the shaving cream I'm using is Tube of Supermax. Now the other day, <laughs> to tell you something funny, I keep these in my cabinet and I nearly ended up brushing my teeth with these bits, a bit tired in the morning, half asleep, going away, and I'm like, oh, you know, you're just about to put some toothpaste on, pick the wrong one up, and you know, luckily I didn't use it, but then I got my own toothpaste on and brushed with that. So again, <laughs> I'm not a fan of these tube things. They're pretty simple to uh, do. Okay, give this a good. I mean, it's been quite a while. It's a shaved so you can you can just see it here. It looks obviously on the video uh, not that thick, but it actually is, and it's starting to itch me a bit now. So you know, we'll see. Really smelling this super max. It's really smelling lovely. I mean, it's not a bad cream for a budget cream. I've yeah, I've tried. I've seen tried worse. A lot of the Gillette ones are not that good. Let's see if we can get some more light in here. That's better. Some more water in there. Lovely. Now let's see if I can get this without getting it everywhere. See if I can do a, a world's first. <laughs> if you get cream everywhere, I've already got a bit here. Wipe that off. So, looking forward to trying these. Um, I'm going to actually tell you a little bit of a fib. I've actually tried these. I think this is my. I think it's my second ever blade. I actually tried, and it was pretty good. But I'll, you know, I'll let you your decision what you think to this. So, I'm going to start with the first pass. Simple and easy. Nice and warm blade. I to say nice and hot blade. I always like to get the blades really, really hot. And they just perform really nice on the hot. So when you put these in warm water, it's okay. When you put these in hot water, it just is brilliant. Again, I find this nice and steady purely because when I first tried this and I didn't know what to do, didn't know how much pressure to use, <laughs> I was bleeding everywhere. But again, nowadays, you know, you get to know your face, you get to know your razors, you get to know how good the creams are. I mean, I started off with creams uh, and now I'm more into soaps. Just like it's for the slickness more than anything. Okay, first pass. Now that's taken quite a chunk off. Not as much as a Kai blade would do. But it's not bad. Lovely strong smelly stuff today. So we're gonna go across this time.
nice and tidy. Make this look so easy nowadays. <laughs> nice and gentle. Right so far, so nice and steady. We always get the bit under the neck going sideways and when it grows. Does anyone else get that? Because it's just I get like a circle here. I have to go over a few areas. No nips, no cuts. Not bad actually, compared to the first first time I used these in my early days. <laughs> it's just a bit of a mess. I did find the uh, with these though. They are quite sharp, but they're not that smooth. Um, but well, I'll tell you what I think this time. It's been quite a long time to use one of these. In fact, it's well over a year since I used one of these. So. Be nice to see what I think nowadays. If the the work is sort. Now it's gonna go against the grain. That's in general. Doing pretty good actually today. Wow, these are quite sharp blades. Okay. Tiny bit of touch up here. No, I did find last time I used these, I got a lot of skin irritation. Feeling I'm going to get a bit this time. If any of my blades get really bad skin irritation, once I posted the video, I'll put in the comments exactly what it does. Still missing the patch here. I don't want to keep going over and over and over, then I will get problems. Yeah, that. <coughs> Don't know what quiet's up in here. Tiny, tiny bit. I'm not going to go over, keep going over that edge. It's just it's not shaving that bit. Okay, 
So, give all this a rinse. my um, shaving panel anywhere. No idea what I've done with that. Too bad today, just a bit along here. <laughs> so, is it okay? No, it's not bad, but there's a little patch here which is just bugging me sometimes. I like to have a really good shave, never have to do any extra effort. A nice blade. So, this little patch is bugging me. I went over two or three times and it's still a bit there. So, um, they are sharp, I must admit. They're very sharp. I feel it's not consistent on shaving though. It's a little bit patchy. I can feel a little bit of soreness from that, like like uh, the Supermax felt like it's not as slick, but I know it's not bad. Maybe some pre-shave oil may help with this. Tell me guys what you think to this. I mean, I use them as a backup blade until I've used them. I don't think I'll buy any more of these. Um, it's definitely a better shave than when I first started. Uh, Again, because I'm getting to, you get to know your face. Okay, so it's not bad that. Uh, what should we use today? What should we use today? Uh, I'm gonna go with this for a change. Uh, again, Clubman Virgin Island Bay Rum. Now, oh yeah, I could just, I could feel like drinking this stuff. <laughs> it smells that good. I do like the Clubman stuff. See how we get on with this. Oof. And I can... Oh, wow. Some serious burn. And that's normally not that bad. But again, I see a bit of redness here. Yeah, it's not. There's going to be some skin irritation with that blade. If you've got sensitive skin like me, I wouldn't bother. But this, oh, it smells good. That does. You know, the wife's going to spot that when I pick her up from work later. <laughs> she's going to go, which one have you got on today? I like that one. Or I don't like it. I get it all the time. I know she's got certain favourite ones, so I test her. Because I know if one she doesn't like, I'll wear it. See if she says she doesn't like it again or doesn't comment. <laughs> anyway, guys. So that's my review of the Wilkinson saw blades. Got to mention they come in this nice little wax wrapper that says Wilkinson sword on. Um, but they're okay, nothing fancy. Uh, let me know what you think. I get on with them. I know I've got some friends that have tried these that really don't like these. Uh, but maybe it's just one of them blades, you know. I think with people with I mean a lot of my friends that try these, they've got a lot thicker hair. So when they come to shave, they say, Oh, I know they're terrible blades, but again, I mine's not too bad, it's quite fair. But anyway guys, thanks for watching again. I really appreciate this. Uh, I do want to give a subscriber giveaway when I get to a certain amount of subscribers, which isn't very many, you know. If I get to, if I get a few more, I'll give some aftershave away, see how we get on. Um, like, comment, subscribe below. 
as always. And I, like I said, I do appreciate you guys and girls and people watching, leaving comments and the whole YouTube community. Uh, thanks for watching. Until next time, happy shaving.